Tom Cruise has been in more than 30 films since the early 80s, but three of his characters have shared the same name. Can you guess it? Well, you're about to find out. This is the Yo Show on Yahoo. All right, we're going to be talking about Tom Cruise's favorite character name from daytime and no time. You know her. You love her. Nikki Boyer is Aww, here. Thanks for having me. Because I love you. <laughs> and he's a great comedian, Mark Serratello. <laughs> Let's jump into it. Oblivion. Tom plays Jack Harper in this post-apocalyptic sci-fi adventure set in the year 2077, and it comes out on April 19th. So he likes the name Jack. Apparently, he really likes it. I am obsessed with the trailer of this movie. It looks so good. Like, the aliens get conquered by the humans, but then Earth is destroyed, so they have to live up in the air. No. And Morgan Freeman is in it. I love that even though the world is ending, Morgan Freeman is still making movies. Morgan like, Freeman he's in every is movie. in every movie. He's in every movie. <laughs> Thank Absolutely. God, I love Absolutely. It. Morgan Freeman is actually in my home Christmas movies from 1986. <laughs> <laughs> really? Just yeah. hanging out Just with hanging the family? Out the background. <laughs> he just finds his that's, way everywhere. That's when he was an extra. That's where he <laughs> right. started his career. And Mark's videos in the background as an extra. You gotta post those, man. They'll go viral it's fast. It's not SAG work, though. <laughs> All right. Now, like his character Jack, Tom is a pilot in real life. And his co-star was freaked out when they got into a real, like, the simulation machine. So that was pretty fun to watch. And earning his pilot license in 1994. Very impressive. Very impressive. Tom Cruise actually bought a World War II era mustache. Mustang Jet, mm -hmm. and in 2006, he had Kiss Me Kate uh, painted on the side. Really? Yeah. All right. In related news, Mel Gibson bought a World War II German tank. What do you have painted on the side? <laughs> also Kiss Me Kate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's talk about Jack Reacher. It is his second time playing Jack. Tom starred as the title character, a former military police officer in this crime thriller that came out last year. Did anybody see this? No. Well, I did. On the plane. I watched it, so Tom, I did see you, I didn't pay for it, but it's on for free. That's what I'm saying. Ah, oh, was it good? I don't know. I didn't even hear about it until I got the breakdown for this show. <laughs> <laughs> Came in far behind The Hobbit. Yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> really Tom, far behind yeah. The Hobbit. Way, way in second place. Ironically, Tom also tested for The Hobbit. Turns out he's too short. <laughs> All right, uh, the film was based on a book series, Jack Reacher, and the title character is supposed to be six foot five, and Tom Cruise is only yeah. five foot seven. But he still got the role, and he nailed it. We just didn't see it. Yeah. He actually said I was six foot five when I jumped up on Oprah's couch. <laughs> you guys remember that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> he was tall in that moment. So so just, my, I have to tell you, my favorite part of the story is that a moviegoer went to the movie was ticked off that the explosion that was in the trailer wasn't featured in the movie, so Paramount actually had to refund the price of his ticket. He was what? mad. I know, isn't that who crazy? Who complains? Who even notices that? Well, uh, apparently this guy. Nerds. Did. Let's talk about Legend. It was Tom's first time playing Jack in this 1986 fantasy directed by Ridley Scott and also starred Mia Sarah from Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Um, this was an interesting trailer to watch. It was very odd and kind of creepy. Yeah? But I secretly liked it. Is that weird? Like, did you ever see it? No, I no. just keep watching the, the trailer, trailer over just the trailer. and over and over again. But 1986 was a super good year for Mia and for Tom because um, both Ferris Bueller and Top Gun were released, you know, not long after uh, this movie was released. So it was a good time for them. And 1986 was a good time for me because it was the year I was born. Really? So, yeah. So you're about the same height as Tom. <laughs> <laughs> I got it a snort too. <laughs> I know. Tim Curry's also in Legend. He's 13 foot tall in his stilts. A full nine feet taller than Tom Cruise, <laughs> also in stilts. <laughs> All right, Nikki, what do you got going on? Uh, I will be on the Wendy Williams show <laughs> Wednesday, 10 a.m. Check it out. I know you did. I don't even know if she said that. Mark, how you doing? Know? How you doing? Yeah. How you doing? All right, Mark, what do you got? Uh, you can check me out at markscomedy.com. It has my calendar on it. Just do stand up all over the country. All right, yeah. perfect. And check out this show every single day, yoshow.yahoo.com. And check me out on TV tonight, OMG Insider. We'll see you next time.